anymore. And that's the first thing I said to Alan when I opened that package up. I said, Alan, I'm not 15, I can't wear this. But I tried it on this morning, and I tried it on with Mom's heels, and it looks good. And, um, I tried it on... Gary? <laughs> Is it uh, on? Yeah, it's on. Can I take right. a wide view first? You know, she won't throw them very high. Is it it's running? on record. Is it running? We're recording. Okay. <laughs> Hello. You know how to do the red. Let's, I want to introduce yourselves. We're in Japan. Yeah. I'm Dick Byerly from Walla Walla, Washington. Well, welcome. Hi. Beth. That's Byerly, Walla Walla, Washington. Hi there. Okay. Karen from Chicago. And uh, you know me. Anyway, I thought we'd start this videotape. Here we are in the airport. We have to make one more introduction. What's that? And one more introduction. Becca from Chicago. And okay. it's, Where um, are we? Yeah. It's 3.52 Houston time in the morning. 15 hours later, it's 18.52 here in Japan. We're waiting for our flight, as you well know. I mean, I'm about to learn how to juggle. So I figured we'd preserve this on film. It's crazy. Well, the you're going to start just doing like McDonald's arches, and you're going to throw one up, and it's one piece, and you're going to throw the second up, and so it's just going to go up, and once you do that, I'll put it in the hand, and you're going to throw the other one, 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 and you're going to throw how many hours are we without sleep <laughs> I'm at 48. <laughs> so I toss this up. Yeah, you want them both to be up. Not you're, so you're high. doing the classic pass across the bottom. Um, yeah, that was better. You can wait a little bit. You mean toss wait. this one? <laughs> toss. You might not want to this on the Toss. Up, up. Toss. I think we're going to stop now. <laughs> okay, let's do it for real. Look at this. <laughs> oh, are you joining us, Agena? <laughs> Woo! All right, thank <laughs> you. Let's see, let's go say hello. Hi. Are you joining us with Gina? Pardon? Are you joining us with Gina? I, I don't know. I just no. Oh, you're just from Houston. Yeah. Hi. How are you? Great. We're in Japan, everyone. <laughs> I, I, I lived there about five years ago. Oh, great. Well, we thought we'd be silly and, and do what tourists do. Well, we're, we're filming. Where are you heading to? Uh, Bangkok. Is this going as far as Bangkok? Yes. Wow. Yeah. So what are you doing here? Um, I'm just on vacation. I'm going to Nepal. Oh, okay. There are a lot of people on their way to Nepal. Are you on your own? I was looking for a couple of them because okay. they might be some I'm, I'm joining. Well, well like the, the nice couple over here from Walla Walla, Oregon, Oregon really? right over there. They're are they going, going to Nepal? They're not going to Kathmandu with a group of four. So they probably already know who they're meeting. And then there's some ladies on, uh, see the lady with the purple parka there, with the red backpack? She's going to Kathmandu. Oh, really? So, I'll just see if they're going to be on the same trek as or, me. I'm going to, I'm taking a trek. It's supposed to be seven people right now. Yeah, here. okay. Well, seems to be a common destination. All right. We're going. We're going to, with a group to uh, Bangkok. Started out three people. Now we're, we're down to two. My husband and myself, and, the lead, and plus our leader. Oh, really? So that should be really neat. Well, this yeah. is a small group, you know. Yeah. Catching. It's better than a hundred or whatever. Yeah, I, live, I, I just came from Alaska. And it's like, oh, I'm, great. Could, I'm all, uh, this, is Alaska it's home right now? Yeah. So I, yeah, I live there. Oh, okay. Ooh, all right. Oh, heat seeking missile. We're not that good. I already warned you of that. Aren't you supposed to lock your feet when you do doubles? What? Don't you do this when you? Oh, no, you don't have to. So that you don't, so you get coordinated. Well, I'm going to wander through the airport. This has been fun. That's what you got to do is not panic. If you can do two, you can do three. But two is the hard part. Throw it right when it's in the middle. And when you first start, the problem is. 
when this one gets in the middle. Yeah, exactly. Or else you end up chasing Say they wanted to come over about 25, and then people that had said we definitely come over about 60 or 70. And there were about 50% girls. I had a 57 Chetty one time. You had a, you had a 50 cent Chetty? A 57 Chetty. Oh, cute, cute. And this is not solid gold, it's gold plating. As you get closer, you can see the gold leaves, but it's still quite beautiful. And they do a lot with their temples with the reflection of the sun. And just some trivia on temples. Um, most temples in Thailand will either face a body of water or they'll face east. Very important to have your temples set up so you do gain the proper merit and all of that, that you have it uh, built in the proper direction. Now you'll see a lot of different influences here at the temple. You'll see some Burmese influence, some of Pioneer. There's an Angkor Wat replica, the big Angkor Wat in Cambodia. Pioneer is in Cambodia. And Angkor Wat is one of the seven wonders of the world in Cambodia, and they have a replica here in the temple. And these dragons are very Chinese looking. So it's very interesting to see how they for meditation. They're open to allow you to get um, the, the winds, the cool breezes, which hopefully we'll be using that today. Now generally too, you'll see in the monastery a lot of steps. And the idea that the um, Thais believe in Buddhism, but before that they believed in animism, belief in spirits. And what the Thais have done is they've kind of taken the good stuff about both uh, philosophies and combined them. The Thais have a way of taking all the good Thank you. 